Good evening, this is Jan and welcome to my kitchen where I'm gonna prepare a very easy shrimp dish Thai style. Here we got the main ingredient black tiger shrimps with the tail on. I'm gonna do the preparations that means the vegetables. Red onion Spring onion just cut this roughly, something like this. And some Chinese cabbage, also sliced roughly, so that the flavor stays beautiful. Plus a handful of cherry tomatoes, which I'm not gonna cut, also because the dish will look more beautiful. Extra vierge olive oil in my hot wok. First in red onion. Plus some cabbage and the cherry tomatoes. I want them to dissolve into the sauce a little bit. And then I must not forget about the spices and the herbs because you must never forget about spices and herbs. So, black pepper. Quite a lot, as always. I mean, yeah, quite a lot. Basil, also a universal herb, I must say. And then some typical Asian spices like ginger and laurel, which is more mild in flavor than ginger. Time to put in the spring onion and of course the shrimp. I have been tossing and turning the shrimp so that they cook evenly. So now it's time to put the sauces, which are soy sauce. I chose for the ketchup acid my favorite soy sauce from Indonesia. Quite salty this one. Finish the bottom. And then of course my all-time favorite sauce from Thailand, Sriracha. And also quite a lot. Just to make sure that this is going to be spicy. And I can tell you, this is going to be spicy very much. I don't like that. I think this is ready. I got my fork and my spoon because that's what you basically need with Thai food except for noodles and stuff like that then you got a spoon and chopsticks but in this case these try it the sauce the vegetables mm. well That sauce is nice, spicy, as I told you before. Also, with the herbs and the spices. Yeah, by the way, I got some steamed rice. I'm 
gonna try this shrimp. So yeah, of course. I choose for shrimp with the tail and the legs and everything, so that makes it a little bit not easy to eat. Well, easy but not quickly. You have to get rid of the tail and the legs. And I did, I managed it as always. Nice with the sauce. Some tissue comes in handy. A really beautiful combination. I love shrimp, I must have said that many times already. Shrimps are my favorite animals. Really, from all the animals. So good. Mm. So tasty. I mean, they're a little bit sweet. Savory, and they can adapt to all the other flavors that you use in the dish. Like this one, get rid of the tail. Beautiful, beautiful with that sauce. Mm. So much flavor, really. tissue so that I can enjoy my beer which is Steenbrugge from Belgium this is a triple which is like a quite strong beer not sure from which city this is I think ah yeah from Brugge yeah from Brugge Bruges that is in uh, English language It's a powerful beer, full-bodied, like basically any triple is, and that is nice with this stuff. Mm. Gonna have some more shrimp. In combination with my triple. Now that is perfect. Oh yeah, these cherry tomatoes. Tomatoes bring much acidity. So in fact does the Sudarsha, together with spiciness, lots of spice of course. It's a nice combination with the spring onion, the Chinese cabbage, everything. Mm. Beautiful. I love these dishes. Easy to make, very flavorsome. These are my kind of dishes, really. Get the tail off, ready again. So, 
I want to thank you for watching this video. I see you in the next one. And remember, keep on enjoying your food like I do. Especially Thai dishes with shrimps, some beer.